We are learning more tonight about a shooting that killed two men in North Minneapolis. It happened in the area of 21st and Sheridan. Here's what authorities had to say. This afternoon, February 10th at approximately 345 in the afternoon, a Minneapolis police officer from the 4th Precinct responded to 2100 block of Sheridan on the reports of shots fired. When they arrived, they found a vehicle that was occupied by two adult males. Both adult males were suffering from apparent gunshot wounds. Officers pulled them from the car, provided medical aid until EMS arrived, and both males were pronounced dead at the scene. We have very little information as to what transpired leading up to the shooting. There are reports that there was an individual leaving the vehicle um, just after the shooting occurred. Minneapolis police crime scene technicians have responded to the scene to, to process the scene and to collect evidence. Homicide investigators are on the scene working to determine exactly what transpired. The identity of both males will be released by the Hennepin County Medical Examiner's Office in the days to come. And because there's so limited information, we are asking anybody who has information or who gains information in the near future to call Crime Stoppers and leave uh, a tip and even an anonymous tip uh, to help investigators along with this investigation. Any questions that we have? Of that possible third person, is there anything you can tell us that people should be on the lookout for if someone fled? Um, we don't have, again, very limited information. We just have the report of somebody leaving the scene. We're trying to determine how that person was involved and how they knew the individuals in that car. Minneapolis police and the community has really been dealing with a lot, just in, even in these last couple of days. Um, thoughts on the violence and uh, what to tell people around here? Everybody's just like, what is going on? We have experienced... Uh, some significant gun violence in the last uh, couple of days. Uh, several shot, now two dead. Um, certainly this is arousing a lot of emotions, even to the point of anger about the gun violence that we're experiencing in our city. Um, there might be a, a, a desire to throw your hands up, give up, but I, uh, I just want to say that Minneapolis Police Department is resolved in uh, maintaining their commitment to solving these kinds of crimes. And I would ask that the community would stand alongside of us on a couple of things. Number one, if you know somebody who has guns, talk with them about uh, putting those guns away and, uh, and, and keeping safe um, and encouraging us uh, to, to, to embrace the sanctity of life and care for one another as if we were caring for our own mothers, fathers, brothers, sisters, uncles, and aunts and others. Um, everybody that we deal with in these situations have families, have friends. Uh, they are deeply meaningful to somebody else. And I just ask that we all treat each other with that same sense of, of, uh, of value. Uh, so let's put the guns down. Um, I would also like to say that uh, the Minneapolis Police Department is, is working diligently to curb cur uh, uh, violent crime in this city. Uh, on a regular basis, we are not only on patrol, but in, in special uh, details uh, going out and we are getting guns off the street every day. Over a thousand last year, and uh, we're on pace this year uh, to, get to keep guns coming off of the street. So, we're working diligently to curb that kind of violence, but we need the community's help in identifying an individual who may have a propensity to violence and talking with them about putting their guns down. We'll have more on the shooting tonight at 10.